Hi, my name is Daniel, and in this video I'll show you how to create charts and graphs and add it to a Flexby website. Let's get started. The Charts and Graphs widget is a great addition to any website. To start, enter Common Ninja website. Choose your widget from our large collection of widgets. And once you've entered the widget page, click on the Create button to enter the editor. Here, in the editor, you can edit the content. Change the chart type. Customize the look and feel. And change the settings. When you're done, click the Save Changes button to save your work. If you don't have an account on Common Ninja yet, you'll have to register first. When you're ready to add the widget to your website, go back to the dashboard. Now, on the dashboard, you'll see the widget you've created. Click on the Add to Website button. In the window that opens, copy the code. And close the window. Remember, you can always return to the widget and keep on editing it. Now, let's head to the Flexby editor. There are two methods you can add the widget to your Flexby website by adding new element to an existing section, or by adding a new section. To add the widget to an existing section, in the Flexby editor, click on Add Element button where you wish the widget to show. Select the HTML element. Click the HTML element added to the page. Now, in the HTML window, simply paste the code you've copied before. Toggle off the Don't Execute JavaScript option and click Apply. Click the X button at the top right corner of the HTML window to close it. And click the Save button at the top right corner of the screen to save your changes. The second method is adding the widget to a new section. Click the Add Section button wherever you wish the widget will show. Click on Others in the left menu. And select the HTML section type. Click on the new HTML section added to the page. Now, in the HTML window, simply paste the code you've copied before. Make sure the option, Don't Execute JavaScript, is inactive. And click Apply. Click the X button at the top right corner of the HTML window to close it. And that's it. Now, the charts and graphs will show on your website.